Hey, so this is my pug Titus, who I catheterize three times a day. We're going to show you how quick and easy it can be uh, when you have everything kind of set up. He's um, sitting on one side of my body with his bum kind of in my crotch, and I've got one hand around his chest so he can't bite me or wriggle loose. Um, normally he actually goes to sleep. Uh, right here we have his little kit set up, so I have a plastic container. Inside it I keep lube, a syringe, disinfecting wipes, and here's the catheter right here. Just to set up, I just kind of dump the kid out and have everything ready before I get him on my lap. This is um, a jar to put the pee in, and then I have some treats handy for him. So first thing I do is just wipe his belly and crotch area off to get any dirt or debris out of the way. I take the catheter, which I have already disinfected using a wipe. I put some lube onto the catheter. And then you kind of have to get his penis to come out a little bit, so you push it out like that. I don't know if you can really see what's happening here, but gently put it into the little hole in the top. And just kind of slide it in. Your vet can tell you how far to push it in. You don't want it to go too far and to hurt him. Um, so ours is about there. Attach the syringe and then you just gently suction. When the syringe fills, I empty it into the jar, reattach, do it all over again. It's hard to show because I'm left-handed. And we just keep doing this until it slows down or it's empty or like we realize his bladder is empty. Um, because this is an invasive procedure, it makes him more prone to UTIs and other infections. So our vet recommended that we keep him really flushed out by adding water to all of his meals. Um, so we do that. He gets about half a cup of water in the morning at dinner time and then before bed we mix it with a little bit of wet food so he'll drink it and that's been really helpful. We also um, give him cranberry supplements, something called D-mannose uh, vitamin, and vitamin C. Okay, so I think we're almost at the end. I'm gonna take the disinfectant wipe and just clean the catheter as I remove it from Titus. I just kind of pull the urine out of the catheter into the syringe, I'll set it aside, I tuck him back in, wipe him down, <laughs> give him a little treat if he's feisty, and off we go.